Our temperatures around the nation showing it's not just cold here in the Panhandle, it's cold everywhere else too. In Denver, we're seeing 32 degrees, Minneapolis 28, in Albuquerque even 37 degrees. So those cold temperatures are typical for this time of year. But let's take a little look closer to home. Panama City 42, Defeniac Springs 41, and Mariana 43. Pretty consistent in the mid to low 40s right now, our temperatures. But our winds right now in Panama City, 6 miles per hour. Over in Pensacola, we have 8 miles per hour and Bluntstown, 8 miles per hour as well. You can see right now the winds are moving towards the west, but Monday morning that should shift and they'll be moving towards the southeast. And I'll have more on that a little bit later in the forecast. Our southeast radar showing a low area of low pressure right now over Texas, which will bring some snow to them. But looking at our area right now, as this area of low pressure moves towards the panhandle, that's when the cloud coverage is going to start coming in tonight and some uh, afternoon showers on Monday, but right now our radar looking pretty clear that precipitation is going to stay out until uh, mid afternoon on Monday and then you can expect some rain. Tonight, our coastal forecast right now, we have a temperature of 38 coastal and inland. Those clouds will start to move in as you can see outside probably about right now. Our winds from the east northeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And if you're trying to plan out your Monday with that rain, you might just want to grab a jacket just in case because 5 a.m. in the morning, if you're getting that early start, we'll have temperatures in the mid 40s, some clouds and showers uh, moving into the morning at 10 a.m. A shower or two. The sun will try to peek in there, but not quite get there and as we move into the afternoon and the evenings those showers are going to stick around and then they will clear up as we get into the night and move into Tuesday those showers and our future cast right now so right now you see the winds kind of moving towards the west but as we go overnight and into Monday you can see the rain start to make its way over the panhandle and Monday there's those spotty showers coming in and out through the out the afternoon and the winds kind of just curl up right over our area as well. And then as we move Monday night into Tuesday, you can see them all settling down, starting to move into the southeast and those clouds going away and those clear skies will be back by Tuesday night. So that'll be nice for the rest of the week. The rainfall on Monday, if you are looking to see how much you're going to get, it's nothing too concerning. Uh, over in Destin, you're going to see just under over a half an inch at 0.65 inches. Mariana, 0.18 inches of rainfall. So it's nothing too crazy. Just those spotty showers that you can have throughout the day on Monday. Our beach forecast for tomorrow, air temperature at 57 degrees, uh, wave height at 1 to 3. We will be flying yellow flags in Walton Bay and Franklin counties. The rain might ruin the beach day if you were planning to go out. But same thing with the boating forecast. We'll have some light and choppy waves out there, some showers. The Gulf waters at 68 right now. And now let's take a look ahead so we're not just talking about the rain. So on Monday, I said there will be some light showers, but that'll clear up into Tuesday, showing sunshine for the rest of the week. Temperatures in the uh, mid 50s into the low 60s. The next front will be on Friday, and that's the next thing you could worry about, bringing some cooler temperatures for the weekend. But the good thing is there's going to be lots of sunshine, even though it is a little bit colder.